Asalaamu Alaikum and hello everyone, hope you're doing well. This video is about beauty tips. So I'm going to start off with my first beauty tip and this is Suda Cream. What I do every two weeks, I, before I go to bed, I put, I wash my feet and stuff and, or you can have it after a shower, you can do this after a shower. What I do is I clean my feet, then put Suda Cream on and then clean pair of socks. I sleep with the pseudo cream on all night and then in the morning I wash off and I'm telling you, your feet will be nice and soft. This prevents you from having hard skin. Well, it does for me, so I can't speak for everybody else. I got this tip from another beauty guru and it's been working for me for a really long time. So if you guys can get pseudo cream, then do so and try it. Maybe try with a small tub because if it doesn't work for you, you don't tend to like waste it but then you can use pseudo cream for other purposes as well because it's such a versatile product so try that and see how that is and comment below if it worked if it didn't work i'm so sorry but it works for me works for me sorry second one is um something to do with face what i do is i cut a tomato in half and i've got all my tips written down the ones that i normally use okay so i cut a tomato in half and i and the juices I sort of like squeeze and then rub it around my face in a circular motion. I leave this juice on for about 10 to 15 minutes and then rinse it off with cold water. And then this sort of like tightens your pores and any sort of natural oils or grease that you have on your face will be removed as well. Well, reduced. So that is a very good thing for me as I have an oily T-zone. Next thing is um, sometime when I do an tutorial or a makeup just to go out I tend to um, just you know do a smoky eye sort of look but when I want a very sharp end like if I want it very sharp like this what I do I put tape along here and then do my makeup and then just peel it off and you get a really nice clean cut so you can use tape for that next thing is gel liner sometimes we have gel liner and then um, at the end of the day we've got like a line on our eyelid in the you know just in the middle we have a line, which is quite annoying and not very attractive and just horrible altogether. So what I do, you can set your gel liner by putting, I normally wear black, so I would use a black eyeshadow, um, do, 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 a black eyeshadow just to set the gel liner and then you won't have that problem. Next one is, which is my last one, is when you're going to choose a foundation, don't test it on your hand because your hand is lighter than your face and it's two different tones. I'll show you. As you can tell, my hands are much lighter than my face. Um, so if you're going to go and test or choose one, test it on your jawline, jawline because that's the best way to, you know, without ruining the whole face. Just use it on the jawline and then you can wipe it off as soon as you've done. So they're my tips. I, I've given you one, two, three, four, five tips. So that's my five tips my five top tips. I've got more, but I thought, let me give you my five top tips and you guys can try it out and let me know how it goes and if it works for you. If it doesn't, I'm sorry, but um, it works for me. So, bye.